though. New explosive discoveries after acid bombs rock an Orange County neighborhood. Good evening to you. I'm Eric Von Eck and glad you're with us. Matt and Lisa are off. Tonight we're learning what investigators found inside a home more than 13 hours after that first boom was reported along Beach Boulevard. That's not far from Orlando's Baldwin Park community. New Six's Troy Campbell is there live getting updates. Troy, are investigators still out there? Well, Eric, investigators just cleared the scene. So right now, for the first time, we're able to give you a closer look at this home. Now, thankfully, no one was harmed when deputies say those devices went off. It's just dangerous. The Orange County Sheriff's Office arresting these two men on charges of possessing or discharging a destructive device. Neighbors calling into 911 after hearing a loud boom near the home on the 4400 block of Beach Boulevard. Scary, unnerving for us that just live down the street. There's a little kids over there. Detective saying 56 year old Bruce Steffenhagen and 37 year old Nathan Martin are responsible for deploying two acid bombs near the home. The SWAT team and FBI bomb detectives called out to the scene after the men refused to come out the house before being arrested several hours later. Once they were able to search inside the home, both county and federal investigators say they found chemicals and materials used to make the acid bombs. News 6 investigated and discovered since the year 2000, Stefan Hagen has been arrested on felony charges of drug possession, burglary and theft. We also found out in just the past two years alone, Martin has been arrested for felony charges of burglary and grand theft. It's dangerous and we're not happy about it. To be doing this in a residential neighborhood, we're so happy that the residents called us to see. And deputies say that four other people were taken out of this home after they refused to come out for about eight hours. Those four were eventually released without any charges. However, Stefan Hagen and Martin, they remain in the Orange County Jail being held without bond. Eric. Yeah, this could have gone differently. Troy Campbell live tonight. Thank you.